Smurfy greetings YouTubers, it is I3 Hellgear, welcome back to Smurf's Epic Run. We're here in Peyo's workshop, and I figure, let's try to knock this out. And I'm rocking Sir Hefty. Sir Hefty is essentially an aesthetic change compared to the regular Hefty. And I'm going to do a little side-by-side -side comparison with these dashers. That being said, thanks as always for coming out to watch and coming out to run with me. That being said, it's time to run. Alright, so let me talk a little bit about the previous episode because you're probably wondering what the deal was with all that. Well, Okay. Oh, not this setup again. Oh, I'm not going to like that. I'm not going to like that at all. Okay, so last episode I used the Black Smurf. And to those of you who are not familiar with Smurf lore, this is how it was. One day, a black fly came around, and it bit the tail of one of the Smurfs. I believe it was Lazy Smurf. <sighs> Don't quote me on that, though. Don't quote me on that. So, Lazy Smurf gets bitten. And he gets bitten in the tail. And as a result of being bitten in the tail, he becomes infected with the very nasty Smurf disease. The disease turns him from his, and I'm quoting Veronica Colorford here, ever blue to black. Oh, come on, I jumped. Bull. Ugh. I'm going to have to adjust the camera. Yeah, I'm not going up there. Screw that. Oh, crap. I forgot I had to go up there because of the red fragment. Oh, not getting the red fragments this time. I missed the first red fragment, you guys, so the red fragment will not be completed. So, anyway, as I was saying, I am not going to like this at all. I'm not. I'm not going to like this at all. Alright, let's switch this up. Snow Leaf, I'm going to have you take five, dude. I want invincibility. Now, back to this. When they're bitten by the, by the black fly, their skin goes from blue to black, their eyes turn red, and all they can say, well, the majority of what they can say is NAP. G-N-A-P. Now, in the actual paperback books sometimes they would also say Nash G-N-A-S-H but mostly it's them saying Nap which if you've seen the cartoon they pronounce the word wrong they would say Gnap you know it's not Gnap it's Nap you know it's like the word gnome it's a silent G like Nap or Gnaw you know, that sort of thing. Now, in many parts of the world, <laughs> this was deemed <laughs> this was deemed racist. So what they did was they changed the skin of the Smurfs from black to purple. 
This is nothing new, you guys. This is this is something that has happened before. I am dying too damn much. <laughs> I am dying too damn much. Five minutes worth of deaths. Ah, I wanted to go up there that time. God. I actually tried to go up there that time, you guys. That was actually one of the instances where you act, where you want to go up there. So when you have invincibility. Very nice. Ooh, dashing saved me from falling into the pits. Man. This is some trippy stuff. I hope you guys can see this all right. This isn't the light. It's actually the background of the stage. It is the background of the stage actually is this bright. That could not have come at a better time. Not even gonna lie, that came at the right time. Thank you, Vine Filter. Er, you're not Vine Filter, you're Reed Filter. Damn it. I always mistake those two. Well, lost him. Didn't lose that guy. I missed one again. Screw this. Let's just get through it. Tired of dying so much. I can miss that red fragment. I didn't get the first one anyway. Ah. Now it's not the first time they turned the black skin characters another color. If you've seen Dragon Ball Z Kai, they did the same thing to Mr. Popo. They changed him from, because you know, Mr. Popo originally has black skin, but they turned him blue. Made him blue skin. Also, the Pokemon Jinx originally had black skin. Again, racist censorship, so they made her skin dark purple. It's the reason why the pre-evolved form, Smoochum, is purple skin. You know, they don't want to offend us people who are darker than blue, as the song says. Now then, we've gone through this stage as, hef as Sir Hefty, now let's do it as regular Hefty. Again, Hefty has a dash ability, Sir Hefty has a dash ability. So essentially, this is a costume change. There's no difference in, in Hefties like there are in Smurfette or Papa Smurf. It's the same it's the same ability. It's just, if you want to look regal, or, well, I can't say regal. If you want to look knightly, and I can just run through all this. Drop down. Yeah. Again, I hope you guys can see that. It, this isn't my camera. It's actually how this particular stage's background is. This 
beige, this pale ginger root colored, yeah, gin, ginger, oh, it's a heart potion. Should have went up. Oh, thank you for grabbing that. Huh. Now that's some diversity for you guys. Invincibility, man. More invincibility. Would have been nice. If I had more invincibility, I would not have lost that one smurf, but it's okay. I have it now, so no complaints. Alrighty then. So yes, everyone knows Peo, Pero, Piero, Culliford never meant to be racist. He never meant to be racist. I'm sure Peo loved black people. Love all people of all complexions. Level up. That plus five is nice, actually. Makes me feel good. So, as you can see, just a dash. You know, no big deal. And you know what? Let's do this. Let's compare another dasher. The Lumberjack Smurf. Yes, I did get him off the bat. He also has a dash, but that first one is for Save Me. Apparently, the first tournament Save Me is free. So, it's a free Save Me when you do tournament runs, when you use our Woodcutter, a.k.a. Lumberjack, a.k.a. Timber Smurf, depending on where you're from. Yeah, him. Now the question is, will the first save me I do from here be free? Thank you, guy on in the back, for rescuing him. I appreciate that. Man, because I remember when I did the first half of this, that was a big issue. Yeah. I know I'm not getting the money like I should, but uh, having the invincibility to go through this is a very useful, oh, couldn't get that big coin, is a very nice thing to have. Not even gonna lie here. That's a big coin. Very nice, very nice. Reload something, huh? Now that's awesome. Well, we just answered something else. Helpers can collect the big fragment, the red fragments too, as you've just seen. All right. And in this stage, no Smurf left behind. Like that. Didn't get the coin requirement, unfortunately, but that's fine. Woo!
pretty hectic there. <laughs> So, if you guys thought I was just doing something completely weird, no, it wasn't anything weird. That was just me playing the role. Or as we, or as they say in show business, getting into character. Yeah, that's right, we're gonna play with Winter Smurf next. He only works in the stadium, like Woodcutter Smurf. His first save me is free, but he has a dash. Winter Smurf gets two golds in the stadium. Plus, he has a dash. Everybody gets a turn. That's right, everybody gets a turn, and I should have stayed down there. Damn it. And it had to be the stage where I had where there were five Smurfs in there that need to be rescued. That was a well played dash right there. That was not a well-played dash. <laughs> Try it again. Try it again. <laughs> Come on, I can't be losing with this Smurf. This guy's name is Winner Smurf, not Loser Smurf. Everybody knows Loser Smurf is a poor sport in checkers. You know what? I missed that one coin in the box to keep alive and grab the uh... dashing save the day. Very nice. <laughs> Dashing because we can. Nope, it's not going to be up there. Thank you guys in the back for rescuing him. I appreciate that. Very nice, very nice. And that was well timed. I lost two guys. Jeez. Oh, they got stuck. I'm so sad. It was going so well. I'm so mad at that. You know what? That was me being fancy pants right there. Everyone likes a winner, but nobody likes a show off. I'm so mad. Yeah, we're gonna save me. It'll get us through the rest of this stage. Plus, we got the red fragment, so yeah. So a lot of people have been saying their pieces when it comes to, I gotta change the music. A 
A lot of people have been saying their piece when it comes to thank you Smokey and Ice Nest. Not them, mind you. They've been saying their piece about the updates with the medals and <laughs> with the metals and the red fragments. They're indifferent about them. Hey, wait a minute. Three more Smurfs and I can get that key. Alright. They've been very indifferent when it comes to the various Smurfs. See, you know what? You dash too, Rainy. But, uh, who else has just a dash? No, you guys don't have just a dash. You know what? Let's take Rainy. Ah, Rainy. I hate saying calling him Rainy. That's just not right. Weather Smurf to finish this off. All right then. Ah. They're trying to figure out well what do the what are the medals for? What are the medals for? And I've explained it to to you guys, okay? I'm gonna be real with you. This is what I think. One, turn the music back on. Two, the medals are for bragging rights. That's essentially what it is. That's how it's always been when you race against your friends in Facebook. And you wanna have the most coins picked up. You know, it's bragging rights. There are there were six Smurfs in this. Wow, this is the first. This is the first stage where I had to actually rescue six Smurfs. Oh, well, there goes one hit. There goes the second hit. And that guy got lost. I'm so glad I picked you for this one, Weather Smurf. Because, uh, yeah. Come on, I have to keep three of these guys. So much for keeping three of these guys. Wow, I missed the magnet potion. Can you believe that? I'm very upset right now. A seven smurf chain. Man, that's crazy. And I don't get the red fragment either. Which is fine. I'm not happy with this. I still have one more Smurf I need to rescue. That was rough. Six Smurf, a seven Smurf chain. Oh man. That's going to be crazy to see. They're not even all going to fit on the big blue bumper. If there are any other stages where you could rescue seven, six Smurfs and have a seven Smurf chain, let me know in the comment section below. That being said, it's time for a new Pussy Willow Pixie. Oh, 
oh, I feel cheated. I feel cheated. That's supposed to be a new pussy little pixie. Did I get everyone? Because that's not supposed to happen. Oh, I feel cheated. That was a cheat. Alchemist Smurf can dash, but I don't have him. No, he glides. Someone else can dash, but I don't have him. Alright. Screw it. Stage 129. Gotta rescue one more Smurf. And I still have time, so why not? Just have to rescue one. Res I bring one home and got the key. And I have two attempts essentially to do this. Oh man. Well, I've got five chances to bring one Smurf home. It's going to be one of them stages, huh? All right. I was not supposed to use that so early. Thank you. Use my hearts too early. Forget it. Forget about it. We've essentially thrown gems out the window again. Oh well. Now we're not even doing that. And the last Smurf is up there. Damn. Unfortunate. Sometimes it's just not meant to be. If you guys enjoyed yourselves, show your love, hit the like button. Want to see more smurfiness? Remember to hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. It's all greatly appreciated. But for now, it's time for me to get up out of here. Raise your thumbs if you enjoyed this one. Showing off all those dashing ones. But now I take my goose from the oven because I'm done. Bye-bye, everybody. Bye-bye.